Hello again, we're back looking at fault codes again on boilers. This time we're looking at the F60 range of fault codes and there's, because there's a range in that particular area of 61, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 67. Now if you've got any of those 60 fault codes coming up on your boiler, it is most likely going to be something to do with this. Now this is the main printed circuit board. They are extremely expensive. Um, and generally speaking, if you've got any of those fault codes, this is going to be the component that needs to be changed anywhere from sort of 150 pounds to 220 depending on where you buy it and the suppliers etc and whether it's a genuine valent part the f61 and 62 fault codes are aimed or can be connected to a faulty gas valve or an interruption of some kind within the gas valve section in which case um, you need to be carrying both components now we carry every part for these boilers on our vans which means we can fix the boiler virtually guaranteed on the visit that we got the first visit when we turn up so uh, if you do have a problem with the F62, F61 fault code, um, it's advisable to have both components, both components on the vehicle, the gas valve and a brand new printed circuit board. Now that gives us a massive advantage because obviously if we put the board on and it doesn't cure the problem, we can then just interchange the parts and put the correct one on. However, if you haven't got, or you don't carry stock on your vehicle, uh, from a consumer's perspective anyway, from uh, it could work out extremely expensive because guesswork will, um, put your credit card into a mega depression. Uh, you cannot afford to get it wrong. So um, yes, nine times out of 10, printed circuit board, all the F60 fault codes, or 61, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 67, uh, possible gas valve fault, um, but you need, really need someone, need someone who knows what they're doing and has carries the parts to be able to interchange them. So there you go, F60, short and sweet. Um, sorry to give you the bad news. Sorry, never mind. next time.